Welcome to the second tutorial in the Stream 101 t uh, video series uh, with Sam Broadcaster. Uh, in this tutorial, it's going to be very similar to the first one. Um, we're going to show you how to connect Sam Broadcaster with an IceCast stream. Um, so just like the first one, you're going to go to your second desktop or wherever your encoder window is. You're going to hit that plus button and you're going to pick that same MP3 encoder. Um, just like the first one, we're going to set this to one second. Um, and if you don't know why, uh, go ahead and check out the uh, first video. It's right in the beginning. Uh, it explains uh, all the reasons why you should uh, do it that way. Again, you're going to pick your bit rate that you pay for. Um, if you're not sure what you're going to do, you're going to go over to the media control panel. Alright, so now this is the Stream 101 media control panel. First thing you have to do is start your server. Um, if you don't start it, you won't be able to broadcast. Um, so you'll see it started and you'll see the server status is online. Uh, next step, uh, you're going to go to Quick Links. Um, just like with the Shoutcast, um, same thing in here. Okay, uh, You're going to take that uh, server host name and you're going to take the server port and uh, the mount point. Uh, first thing we're going to look at though is the bitrate. Uh, on this example we have a bitrate of 96. So we go back into our Sam Broadcaster, choose 96. Uh, we're going to leave it at stereo, stereo and we're going to uh, always leave that sample rate at auto. Go on over to server details. This time, uh, first time we had Shoutcast, now we're going to have Icecast. Uh, by default, Icecast 2 is already selected. We're going to go back to that media control panel. Uh, we'll highlight server host name, which is the same thing as the IP. We'll right click and copy. We'll go in here and we'll paste it. Oh. Got a, some extra space there. Uh, we'll go back for that port number and we'll paste that in there too. Okay, Password just like before, uh, the source password from our stream settings. Um, we're going to ignore that, not click that right now. Uh, you'll notice that this mount point is slash live. Um, by default Sam Broadcaster already has that as the mount point. So we'll go back here again. Uh, click on stream settings. Uh, this source password by default is what you logged into the server control area, the media control panel with. Um, if you do want to change it, go ahead and change it here, hit update, and then you must restart the server. Otherwise, the password will not take effect. Okay? So we'll go back to Sam Broadcaster, we'll put in the password. Uh, this information is pretty self explanatory. Station details Stream 101 demo station. Station description, uh, playing Stream 101 songs. Uh, genre, make sure you do pick something, otherwise you won't be listed very well. Um, we're going to go ahead and pick country again. Uh, website, change that to your website. Oops, stream101.com. And again, list on public station listing. It'll list it in IceCast directories and station listing directories. Uh, if you don't want that, uncheck it. If you do want it, uh, which I suggest, uh, leave it checked. Go ahead and hit OK. Since we did do the automatic uh, settings before, um, you'll see right here, uh, this is our IceCast stream. Uh, the one up here is the demo from earlier that we did, uh, the Shoutcast. But you'll see it automatically started encoding. So you're going to go ahead and go back. Uh, now you can go ahead and play a song. So you have a song playing. Um, so you go back to the media control panel, hit over. We have the song is playing, source is connected. Um, it doesn't have the song currently available. Sometimes it takes one or two songs before it does become available. So um, that's how you do it. Setting up IceCast with Sam Broadcaster.